Hi, Booster Brickers, Lego fans. We are working on the April to May challenge box from Booster Bricks. And the theme is Brickleyville, Hollywood. We are working on the spotlight piece of the month. Every month, you get a little bookmark and a piece that goes along with the story. The bookmark gives you some interesting information about that piece when it was first released, how many different sets it's used in. In the story this month, this piece is supposed to be a handle-like prop. And the prop is a, is a space spaceship generator for the movie. So using this piece and up to 15 pieces from my collection, we are going to create a spaceship generator prop. Let me pull out some pieces and we'll get to building. All right. Grabbed out a handful of parts, different varieties. Some of them have prints on them. I chose to keep my parts on the small side. Since this is supposed to be a prop in a movie that my little minifigure has to carry around, I didn't want to make it too big and cumbersome. So we have to use this piece and we can only use 15 of these other pieces. Let's get to building, see what we can come up with. All right, I'm done. So I used the main piece, the spotlight piece, and exactly 15 other pieces from my collection. And I chose to think of this as <clears throat> something that can be thrown down. And then the control panels come up. You can input information about the ship you want on the keypad. There's a little dial to make sure that you don't go overboard. And then you've got your your push buttons. The the big red one is the emergency stop. Yellow's get ready, green is go. And once you've got all that in, you hit the go button and this thing starts spinning and it generates a spaceship. It folds up so that you can carry it around without it being too, too cumbersome. I like it. What would you have built for a spaceship generator? Starting off with this piece. Thanks for watching Amy's Lego channel. And until next time, happy building.